So far I noticed, okay, I was about to say that there's no enemies on the rooftops, but uh, you just see it they're spawning very slightly. Let's see, uh, drop down here. <coughs> and get back up here. Uh, whatever. Fine. I might want to hit up the bank, too. Now I have some, uh, money in there. Here we go. Uh, let's see. Plus I can hit up the blacksmith as well. So first, the bank. Alright, here. Alright. Good. And then... Blacksmith. All right. Let's get some armor here. Not gonna have enough for everything, I don't think. But we'll at least get the. That's all I can afford for now. Alright, let's see, we are heading out this way. Ugh, get the fuck out of my way, people. Bizarre as always. A little bit of a maze. Find the shortest way out, there we go. Let's see if we can get Sophia. Here. Obviously, she's not going to be in a bookshop. They know her name, therefore, they know she owns this place. If attacked, kill five guards in close combat without getting hit. Alright. See if we can do that. So. I hear her. Could be hiding in the uh, place. You have earned your rest, brother. Requiescat in pace. That sucks. Brothers, sisters, the whole city rises against us, while Yusuf's murderer waits and watches from the arsenal, laughing. Fight with me, and show him what it means to cross the assassins. Damn right. Fuck some shit up. It's epic music here. <laughs> Find and kill Ahmed. Alright. Madman. Kill him all. Gotcha. Right. Now. Oh, 
Oh, I was going after him. Nice. Boom. Get this going. This is a long ass fucking combo. Just got interrupted. Alright, whatever. I don't really need to focus on them anyway because I got these assassins here. Go. are going uh, this way. Now. Now. Got you, bitch. <laughs> oh, you dick. Fine, fine. Go around. Time to die, bitch. Where is she? <laughs> Such fury. Where is she? If you think you are in a position to negotiate, kill me and be done with it. I am sorry it had to come to this. Two men who should be friends, quarreling over the keys to a library. We both strive for the same end, Ezio. Only our methods differ. Do you not see that? Peace, stability, a world where men live without fear. People desire the truth, yes. But even when they have it, they refuse to look. How do we fight this kind of ignorance? Liberty can be messy, Ahmed. But it is priceless. Of course. And when things fall apart, and the lights of civilization dim, Ezio Auditore can stand above the darkness and say proudly, I stayed true to my creed. I will open that library, and I will find the Grand Temple. And with the power that is hidden there, I will destroy the superstitions that keep men divided. Not in this life, Ahmed. Bring the seals to Galata Tower when you are ready. Do this, and Sophia will be spared. My brother's army will be here soon, Ezio. After that, everything changes. How long have you been here? Long enough? I had Ahmed tell as soon as he returned. But I never expected to hear... all this. And what do you think? He is a sincere man. But this Templar fantasy of his is dangerous. It flies in the face of reality. The world is a tapestry of many colors and patterns. A just leader would celebrate this, not seek to unravel it. He fears the disorder that comes from difference. That is why we make laws to live by. A kanun that applies to all in equal measure. Shastadem! Stand back! Hold, soldier! This man is not our enemy. What a challenge it would be to have a son like you. You are not dead yet, old friend. Ezio, spare my uncle if you can. Would your father? No. Mm-hmm. All right. Start picking up. <laughs> Let's see. Nothing I can do from the rooftops here, so I got to drop on down. Oh, the dead bodies. Not my fault. They came after me. <coughs> it's kind of weird to see no one in the streets, so. though. Alright, let's go uh, send our assassins doing some shit here. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and upgrade. Let's see, uh, fifty nine per cent. Very nice. Holy shit. Pile of codex. Fifteen. Kind of want to start the uh, out. Start taking over every single area. Claim the city. Ah, shit! See, it needs that many. Do it. It's tough. That's tough. I'll send him and uh, those guys. Nah, I'll just go the ninety nine percent. Say that should be good. All right. Can't get Jerusalem then. Yeah, okay, I can go straight up with this. We'll go nap Jerusalem. And then uh, I can send these guys out to, let's see. Algiers needs uh, some control. Let's see, 15. I know you can do on your own. 30, you can't, so let's go do the 15. Send you, Bursa. No, not that. Let's see, uh, uh, you can't do a twenty, can you? It'll take two of you to do that. Fine. Go do that. That's twenty-seven. Fine. Alexandria. Let's do the fifteen over here. Alright, so they're all doing their stuff. Good. If I can get fucking out of this place. Head one up. Let's see, how the hell do I get out of here? Fuck, dude. Oop, I found a thing. Uh, did I read it? No, not yet. Let's head up here. There we go. Alright, where the fuck is the... Here it is. Thank you. <laughs> Drop. Alright. Let's go grab this. Here's a church. Let's see. Rob that guy a little bit. Alright, so where are we running to? It's pissed off. We actually gonna go, uh... Go to the place that he wants us to go to get the keys, and then uh, ambush him, or what? Let's see. Kill this fucker, though, I know that. Boom, bitch. Haha. <laughs> Boom! Ooh! Very nice. Let's 
go over here. Nab this. Oh, what is up there? It looks like another, uh, fragment, maybe? Aha! Oh, shit, it went this way. Oh, well. Still in the same general direction. Here. Fuck you. Hop over here. Alright, let's see. Wrap on down, please. Or not. There we go. Yeah, I'll just swim there. Fuck it. I can swim. Still don't understand this fast swim thing. Oh, there it is. It is a little faster. That works. But it probably would have been <laughs> just as fast to run over and find the uh, ferry. Still. Oh well. Uh, call it a physical feat here to swim across the, I guess it's a channel maybe? Swim across the channel. Like a boss. Oop, and there is a, uh... Who are you? Oh, you're the ferryman? Yeah, the ferryman. Gotcha. Alright, so where are we headed? Oh, maybe back to the HQ. That might be it. Oh, you're not gonna be... Okay, whatever. Because you can't fucking climb. Alright, so let's make our way back to HQ here. Get up, Harold. Recklessness? This is not recklessness. Oh, that was recklessness. Okay. Root out the madman and kill them. What the fuck was that? Whatever. Fuck you. By the damnable axe of the assassin brother. We'll go this way. Let's see. Damn it. <laughs> there we go. I was going to say. Alright, so we're in our little, uh, area here. Yeah, this is HQ. No, what? Not what I wanted. Back down. Back down. Enter there. Alright. Let's go back to the keys. No, yeah, why do I always go into this room first? Alright, now what are we doing here? The exchange. Alright, rescue her before she loses 50% health. I'm gonna hurt her. Those bastards. Alright, find the fellow assassins. Let's see, head on out here. Alright, so we're getting ready to make this exchange here. Actually, I do need to repair my shit. I made the 
most pointed out. Yeah, I read it during the cutscene, Patriots fan. That was pretty good. Especially for a short one. I think I'm going to focus on the game now. This is really getting into it, which is good. Ugh. Ugh. Stop running up stupid shit. Alright, let's see. Now. Yes, I did. I got a nice chuckle out of it, man. Mentor? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you, assassin. And I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women? And to maintain the dignity of our order, as Yusuf did with such passion. It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is close. Take positions around the tower, and wait for my command. Eat the exchange, all right. from all my cities, damn right. What the fuck? <laughs> Just fell right on my fucking face, dude. Alright, fuck it. Fuck it. Where is she? I admire you, Ezio. But your bloodlust makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust. A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. He was to be kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded a hero. More or less. Now, the keys. First, the girl. <laughs> She's all yours. Sophia! Tell your men to back off. She's all yours. Climb the tower and rescue her. Alright, whoop. Of course, what's the wrong way? Yes, you know we're now under R. There we go. Start taking up all the cities. He's been promoted to warrior. Ha <laughs> ha. Hop up, hop up. Yes, we got Jerusalem as well. Okay, up here. Ah, shit. Come on. There we go. Almost there. Oh, she's above me still. Alright. I was gonna say, I'm like, it's not her. I knew it. Push her. Push her. Watch this. Watch this, bitch. Yeah. Alright. Fuck you guys. 
guys. Whoop, 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 whoop. Nice. Help. What? That's not my fault. Are you hurt? <coughs> not, not hurt, but very confused. I did not mean to drag you into this. I am sorry. And you are not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening, Ezio. Who are these men? Run! All right, back to horseback for the beginning of the game here. Yeah, 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 throw it in my face. I know, I failed. All right, so it looks like there's a uh, small possibility. I'm not going to say there's a definite possibility, but there's a small possibility that I might actually finish the game on this cast. Uh, I am going for another hour and a half here. Now I would guess and say we're almost done with this uh, memory, and there should be one more memory left. So we'll see. I'm not going to rush it though, because we can always finish tomorrow. It's the end of the road. Kill 20 guards. Alright. Chase scene going. We are close. Keep steady. Well, well. You have come to see me off. Yep. Boom. Cheers, those fucking guns. Ugh. Ah, uh, uh, that's weak, dude. And fucking double team. Ah, team in his hand. Whoa, no! Ha ha! Victory's mine. Killed them both. Bitch. Invented paragliding. I don't think so. Hold on. Throw. Obviously. Throw and assassinate. Like what? Oh no. What? The fuck am I supposed to do here? I guess it's later that I do that. Cause right now, it's just avoiding the fucking buildings. Haha. <laughs> I am all right. Soldiers, up here ahead. Are. All right. I see them. <laughs> Looks like I just bitch slapped him. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. Nice. Throw is awesome. Oh, so close. More enemies. I know, I know. Whoop. Whoop. Kill yourself, Sophia. Four soldiers. Oh, come on. There it is. Oh, what the fuck? Get him. There it is. 
Nice! I <laughs> threw it at the other guy. Just like I wanted. Alright, let's see. Uh, I can't target them. Dicks. Austin! Come on. Gotcha, bitch! Haha, -ha, knocked him off. Let's get this guy a little closer. There it is. Bitch slap and kicked. Haha! -ha. Oh, come on, I tried to throw at that guy. Oh, well. Oh! Yeah! Shit! There we go. Keeping us on track. Alright, gotta avoid the buildings. Ugh. Dick. Oh my. Please move. Up this way. Come on, I tried as much as I could. It's not going that way. What the fuck? <laughs> Your determination will be charming. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. Target someone, target someone, target. Or not. Ah, come on. Got you. Got you. Very good. Ah, uh, fuck. Oh, right in between them. <laughs> there it is. Now let's hopefully target someone. That there we go. Thank you. Aha, twenty guards. Ah, dick. It was that. Yeah, yeah. Let's throw it at this guy. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah. Looks like we're uh, climbing a mountain here. Got seen. Hey, it's your look. Alright, let's go land on that carriage. Or not. Guess what, bitch? We did! <laughs> I am defending, what the fuck? Smack him into the wall, please. That'd be awesome. Yeah, yeah. Just like that. You didn't get to see it, but you know he just went face first right into that fucking wall. Still alive. Nah. So what now, it's you? How does this end? I am wondering that myself. Bury him up to his head. That way you don't kill him like you promised. But uh oh. they can do what they want to him. Soldiers! Selim is not your master! You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? He stands before you, brother. 
father made his choice. <coughs> Selim! Stop! Please! So, you are the assassin. It's your auditory. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. <laughs> You did the right thing, Ezio. This is not your fight. But where does one end and the next begin? Oh. All right. That's the end of the memory sequence, I would assume. It is, alright. So I'm going to do uh, Desmond's final thing, and then we'll start the Bill, final sequence. Good to see you. Listen, we've got a customs officer waiting to talk to everyone. I hope you have something for us. Absolutely. Passports and papers for everyone. Ah, brilliant. So I'm... I'm what? A neurosurgeon now, am I? You're a medical team from SUNY Upstate. Just back from Rome with your patient. Experimental gene therapy. Good work. Let's get this over with. Wait, look! This is crazy! What's wrong? I'm not sure, but Desmond's brain is lighting up like a string of firecrackers. Alright. Uh-oh. Here it comes. What is that? What's going on? This is the end, Desmond. Scheduled for deletion. What are you doing? What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live. The tales we tell ourselves. Don't do this. I'm saving you, idiot. Go! No! So the Animus is trying to delete us. Interesting. I write these lines with a steady hand and a light heart. We are in Ak right now, Sophia and I, with the five Masyaf keys in our possession and all the time in the world. Sophia is a seasoned traveler and a fine companion to have so far from home. Tomorrow we will make our way to Masyaf, and once there, into Altair's library to fulfill our father's forgotten dream. Forgive the shortness of this letter, dear sister, for it is late and we are tired. Perhaps with luck, the next words you hear from me will be in person. Con affetto, Ezio. A homecoming. Alright. So we are on the uh, final memory sequence here. It's time to open the library. Okay. Come, we must hurry. 
I guess I can't go back to Animus Such Island. A climb. Can I? Nope. All right. È così bello qui. This is where your order began. It began thousands of years ago, but here it was reborn. By the man you mentioned, Altair. Altair ibn La Ahad. He built us up and set us free. He saw the folly of keeping a castle like this. It had become a symbol of arrogance and a beacon for all our enemies. And the mandate for menacing hoods? <laughs> Look at was that. that his idea as well? <laughs> you mentioned a creed before. What is it? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. That is rather cynical. It would be if it were doctrine. But it is merely an observation of the nature of reality. To say that nothing is true is to realize that the foundations of society are fragile and that we must be the shepherds of our own civilization. To say that everything is permitted is to understand that we are the architects of our actions and that we must live with their consequences, whether glorious or tragic. All right, let's get in here. Do you regret your decision to live as an assassin for so long? I do not remember making that decision. This life, it chose me. For three decades, I have served the memory of my father and my brothers, and fought for those who have suffered the pain of injustice. I do not regret those years, but it is time to live for myself. Hey, Morgs, welcome. Go. You love the message of the Assassin's Creed let series? Go of all of this. I agree. Then let go. It's very cool. Very thought provoking, really. The end of the road. Alright, use the keys. What do you hope to find behind that door? Hmm. Alright. Knowledge. Above Let's try else. to uh Altair was a profound out. man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. I would say I think I see what's going on he saw here. Saw many things in his life and learned many secrets, both troubling and strange. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Does that worry you? Thank you, Morgs, for the follow, man. I appreciate it. Sophia. You should know by now that I am not a lesser man. I had right. Actually, I have no clue what's going on here. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Uh, that's what I thought. Yeah, I'll like their constellations. Alright, so... How do I get one to... Uh... If I can, because that one's connected like that. Ah, shit. That, that's not going to be it. That's not going to be it. Hmm. Fuck me. <laughs> I have no clue what I'm doing. That no, that's not there. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. All right. So I'm thinking, well, obviously it needs to be rotated, but ha ha, victory is mine. Let's see. Uh, need a twofer. So I'm thinking maybe here. Really? So, oh, okay, so is it actually this one that it gets filled up? It is. Alright, so that's the one we unlock right here. You had better come out of there alive. I plan to. Welcome back, Pages fan. Let's explore the library. 
see what kind of wonders are down here. Right. A light every bit of the way. This is the library. Interesting. Looks like there's this is like a meeting hall or something. No books. No wisdom. Just you, fratello mio. Really? That's crazy. He died there. Just sitting there. Guarding his final memory. That's cool. That's awesome. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what this is. Although I'm thinking, obviously, it's uh, where he hid the um, golden apple, or apple of Eden, whatever. We'll see. You have seen to my books? Yes. Some we sent with the polos. The rest will go with me to Alexandria. Good. Very good. Father, I do not understand. Why did you build a library if you did not intend to keep your books? You should go. When the Mongols return, Masyaf must be empty. I see. This is not a library at all. It is a vault. It must stay hidden, Darim. Far from eager hands. At least until it has passed on the secret it contains. What secret? Go, son. Go be with your family. And live well. All that is good in me began with you, father. Awesome. In much wisdom is much grief, and he that increaseth knowledge increaseth sorrow. What does it tell you? What do you see? Strange put out the messages fire? of ones who came before, of their rise and their fall. But what happens to us, Altair? To our family, what does the apple say? Who were the ones who came before? What brought them here? How long ago? Yeah, I know that's what I'm thinking more is that he was dedicated. This is my duty, Maria. Willing to die alone, locked in a if you are temple asked. here. Say I sent the apple away. Tell them I sent it to Cyprus or Sipango or that I dropped it into the sea. Tell them anything to keep men away from this place. This apple must not be found. Not until the time is right. Sit a moment and rest. Oh, oh my god. This is so awesome. <laughs> yes, I want to see. This is just so fucking great. That die. Holy shit, this is it. You know what? I bet the apple was actually kind of keeping him alive. That's probably what it was. So when he the, put the apple away, he knew he was just going to die very quickly. Still though, this is awesome. Yes. Yes. Hell yeah.
Go get that apple. Alright, got a long loading screen here. There we go. Another artifact. No. You will stay here. I have seen enough for one life. Desmond? He's talking to me? I heard your name once before, Desmond. A long time ago. I literally just got chills. My mind. Holy shit. An image from an old dream. I do not know where you are, or by what means you can hear me. But I know you are listening. Like, I got so many fucking chills right now, this is crazy. I've never got chills from a game before. I'm loving this so much, holy shit. I have lived my life as best I could. Not knowing its purpose, but drawn forward like a moth to a distant moon. And here at last, I discover a strange truth. But I am only a conduit for a message that eludes my understanding. Who are we, who have been so blessed, to share our stories like this? To speak across centuries? Maybe you will answer all the questions I have asked. Maybe you will be the one to make all this suffering worth something in the end. Now, listen. Holy shit, got chills again. <laughs> that was awesome, man. Yes! Do you hear me, Cypher? Can you see me? Strange place, this nexus of time. I am not used to the calculations. That has always been Minerva's domain. I see you still have many questions. Who were we? What became of us? What do we desire of you? You will have your answers. Only listen, and I will tell you how. Both before the end and after, we sought to save the world. We built vaults within which to work, each dedicated to a different method of salvation. They were placed underground to avoid the war which raged above, and also as a precaution should we fail in our efforts. Each vault's knowledge was transmitted to a single place. It was our duty, mine, Minerva's, and Juno's, to sort and sample all that was collected. We chose those solutions which held the most promise and devoted ourselves to testing their merits. <laughs> Welcome, Six monkey. We tried in succession, each more encouraging than the last, but none worked. And then the world ended. We are very close to the end here. You're hitting those revelations, as the game would say. Wow, okay, this game is stuttering right now. I'm having a great time, monkey. How you doing?
The earth shook for days, the fires burned for weeks, and when the ash had settled, less than 10,000 of your kind still lived, and far fewer of ours. But we carried on, together, to rebuild, to renew. Listen, you must go there, to the place where we labored, labored and lost. Take my words, pass them from your head into your hands. That is how you will open the way. But be warned, much still remains in flux, and I do not know how things will end, either in my time or yours. Look, his vitals are stabilizing. Something's happening. He's... he's moving. Desmond, can you hear me? Son? I know what we need to do. Hell yeah. <laughs> I feel you, monkey. I definitely feel you. Uh, but honestly, in my opinion, because uh, I also took those advanced classes and all that. Wait, what? That's it? What? Nah. What? No. There has to be more than this. Anyway, I'll keep talking. Uh, <laughs> I took those advanced classes as well. And uh, honestly, in my opinion, I'd say that like school like uh, whatever you want to call it high school middle school like the the lower schools they're actually uh, a lot harder or more well I don't want to say more demanding but they're, I'd say they're a lot harder than uh, college um, I mean college is more condensed meaning that uh, that like uh, you have to um, you have a shorter period of time to do stuff but I'd say the work that you have to do in like high school and middle school and all that is actually a lot a lot more uh, difficult to do. I don't know. But I mean, yeah, I, I feel what you're saying though. As long as you can do it, it sucks. It's a pain in the ass. But uh, it really is going to help you for college and all that because <laughs> college is going to seem like a really easy thing. Like you'll still get in trouble every now and then with certain stuff, but... Uh, You'll definitely be fine. But yeah, I feel you, man. I definitely feel you there. Okay, I can't skip this part. Alright, so you have to play AC3 to find out. Okay. Gotcha. Good thing I have it. <laughs> so that did end on a fucking cliffhanger. God damn. Alright, so do we actually have to watch this? I can't skip this. That's right. Yeah, it's Ubisoft. Ubisoft likes to uh, <laughs> force you to watch their credits. That's cool though. So I'm thinking just looking ahead here, um nothing after the credits. <laughs> that sucks. But uh, I do have to do uh, Desmond's final memory, though, so I'll probably do that. AC3 Riot. <laughs> Come on, we really gotta sit through all this crap. And they've got like fucking 50 studios to go through, too. Ugh. But uh, I do kind of have my games planned out what I'll be playing next. Um, let me lower the volume just to make sure, because I know for me it's really loud. Uh, while I'm talking, at least I'll lower it, I'll turn it back up after I'm done. But uh, anyway, I got my next games planned out basically. Uh, 
what I've been doing is I've been doing Assassin's Creed during the weekdays and The Witcher during the weekends. Uh, so obviously I just finished Assassin's Creed. If I stream tomorrow, which I should, I'll probably stream tomorrow for a little bit. I do a class at night and all that in the evening, but uh, I'll, I'll probably stream a little bit. Uh, I'll probably be streaming this and I'll just be messing around trying to uh, collect shit and everything. Who knows? Maybe I'll do some random game for a little bit. I don't know. But um, anyway, I'll be playing The Witcher on the weekend, so I'll continue that. Um, maybe, I, I haven't really decided, maybe I'll do The Witcher full time then, so instead of just the weekends, I'll do The Witcher during the week as well. Uh, I don't know. But I know that um, the next game that I'm starting for the stream will be uh, Tales of Symphonia Chronicles play Minecraft. Hey, who knows? I might. I might. Uh, no, I do not do the multiplayer. I'm not really much of a multiplayer person, honestly. Although, I mean, this is obviously a lot different than the traditional multiplayer shooter stuff, so that's kind of cool. CSGO. I remember playing the original Counter-Strikes, um, I don't know, I'd say like 10 years ago. <laughs> So, I don't know, I'm not much of a uh, fast-paced shooter type of person, like, as when it comes to uh, playing against people, but, uh, who knows? Who knows, but, yeah, uh, I'll try to be on tomorrow again, uh, I got class and all that, but I'll see if I'm on. If I am, like I said, it'll either be this, or maybe some, like, random-ass game, who knows? Um, but then I'll be playing The Witcher, and then the next game I'm starting is Tales of Symphonia Chronicles. That's actually two games. It's Tales of Symphonia, and then uh, Tales of Symphonia uh, Dawn or New Dawn or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Counter, uh, Counter Strike is definitely a big type of uh, shooter. Wow, my capture card's derping out right now. But it's definitely a popular shooter. Ah, you don't have a PC. Well, that's why. Yes, it's definitely a very popular shooter for the PC. And then. Uh, Global Offensive is the newest incarnation. Mortal Kombat versus DC. <laughs> Ugh, come on. Fucking credits. I want to do this Desmond thing. But this was fun. Especially that uh, last bit there. Yeah, Counter-Strike isn't really too, um, computer-demanding, really. It's not too hard on it, because it is kind of old now. <laughs> Stick with the Xbox, yeah. <laughs> PC Master Race. All right, come on, credits. It's taking forever. Ugh. This will be dumb sometime. Yes, keep calm and love pugs. Exactly. Exactly. I don't know if that's a real statistic, Monkey, but if it is, that would be fucking crazy. But I don't think it is, because that's four billion, and, uh, no. <laughs> they haven't, four billion haven't joined in three months. <laughs> I would say not. Yes, I know, Ubisoft credits are super long, because they have, like, literally about, like, five or six different studios that work on it. So, I mean, not only do they have the additional thank yous and all that stuff, there's a bunch of shit. takes forever. I mean, this is basically the gist of the whole thing. All I'll be doing is a Desmond's final memory. So, I mean, we'll see what's up with that. The uh, Tetris slash portal type of thing. It's real? Wow. That's crazy. Huge number. You're at 
the functionality testers. <laughs> Alright, monkey. Thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate it. It's always great to have you here. Uh, what do you mean, Pacers fan? Who had a bad day? Come on. Uh, why do I keep hitting start? Stop doing that. <laughs> it just pauses the game. <laughs> Alright. In the meantime, let's see. Uh, what other junk? I'll look at the trophies. Cause I probably check them out off stream or something. I'm not going to platinum the game because I'm not doing multiplayer, so... Anything important here? Uh, let's see, complete the sequences. Yeah, 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 I'll do that. The way I, I don't think I have seven trainees to reach Master Assassin, so I'll probably do that. Uh, let's see. Looks like I can do the climbing thing. Silent but deadly. Parachute off a zip line. Alright. Books. <laughs> Bomb missions. Uh, let's see. Mouse trap. Poison some guards. That'd be nice. Uh, five cards in five seconds. I've already got that. Let's see. Alright, I got the I can see you. Complete the Hagia Sophia challenge level. I don't know what that is. Uh, let's see. Data fragments. Got the bully thing. Control all cities simultaneously, I can probably do. That one looks tough too. Alright, so that's the trophies. <laughs> yeah, Morgs. It's been very fun watching. Playing. Solid game here. Thank you for stopping by, man. Thank you for the follow, too. I really appreciate that. It's very cool. Oh, God, come on. Still programmers, artists, tool testers. Like, come on, dude. There's not much else to do, anyway. It's just fucking around and having fun. But uh, there's no much, not much storage. Just the one thing to do, and that's it. All right. Oh, okay. So do I know who had a bad day? Um. No, I don't. <laughs> I know you said you had a bad day, though. Come on, mobile programmers? What the fuck, dude? No one needs this shit. Ugh. Taking fucking forever. Superman had <laughs> a really bad day. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering where you're going with that. I'm like, what are you talking about? All right, gotcha, gotcha. All right. One of these days, these credits will be over. 
Doesn't seem like it's anytime soon, though. Taking forever. Alright. Scenario directors. Ugh, come on. Alright, whatever. CMK analysis. It's like, really? Come on, dude. <laughs> Good old Chuck Doris. Alright, now they're just saying special thanks and normal thanks, so it looks like we're finally... Closing on the end here. There we go. Legal notices. All right. Finally. Good God. Come on with these fucking images. Yes, I get a lot of stuff here. Justice League versus Wimpy Superman. Obviously Justice League. All right, here we go. After these super long credits, let's do the final Desmond memory here. Wait, is this one? No, it's not. Okay, good. So this is the final Desmond memory here. Let's check this out. Gret. Uh-oh. Let's check out what he regrets. So we are finally in a memory archive E. Recursive idle state instability. Stack overflow imminent. Alright. Stack overflow imminent. Oh shit.
Yes, you have been here the entire time. I uh, thank you for that, Pacers fan. The hell? Okay, I gotcha. All right. Oh shit! All right. After nine years of being away, my old bitterness was back. I was tired again. I didn't want to admit that moving forward might mean taking a step back. But the shine of the city had faded. The freedom I felt was hollow without old friends, without family. And then... Then they came for me. Abstergo. They had been looking for me. I couldn't believe it. Mr. Miles. Yeah? I spent half my life trying to forget everything my parents taught me. Everything I thought was a lie. Desmond Miles. Yeah, what's this about? And suddenly, I wanted it all back. All that training. All that time. But I couldn't. Yeah, uh, shit. They were gone. Why are you doing this to me? You have information No. me. All right. <laughs> Information? I'm a bartender, for Christ's sake. We know who you are. What you are. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. You've got something my employers want. Locked away in that head of yours. Bastards! Mm. Ugh, fuck me. Goo, 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 ha ha! Ah, shit. Pop, thank you. There is it. Oh, it's all the way down there. Ah, shit. Alright. I'll wait for it to come back. Yo, just made that. Holy shit. It even pushed me out of the way. <laughs> Back to the elevator, which we'll have to go up ourselves. Right. Going up. There. Nothing that way, it looks like. That's not a switch or anything. Oh. Uh -oh. Alright. Interesting. In a few short months, my life changed forever. I know my easiest days are behind me, but I don't want them back. Not now. Ah, you dick. Oh, okay, I see ya. Just chopping. Easy. It's over there. Uh, which way do I go? I'll go this way. Okay, I can't go that way. But we'll go this way. <laughs> Go, 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 go. Alright, good. What's this dick doing? Easy. My name is Desmond Miles. Aha! Uh -huh. And I am an assassin. I thought I saw the Abstergo logo. I was gonna say. Back to Abstergo. It all began. Well, not really, but still. An assassin. So that is the final memory of Desmond. Boom! You Desmond Miles? The bartender from New York?
All right, sweet. So all that's left to do is just mess around, earn some more trophies. Not too many more, but you know, we'll see. Go ahead and load this. Throw us back out to Animus Island. <laughs> Very nice Pacers fan. Alright, well that is uh all the story related content, at least. And uh most of well not most of the trophies, but you know, enough for a playthrough's worth. So this is then, in fact, Assassin's Creed Revelations. Um had a lot of fun playing it. I'd say, uh, again, because I space the games out myself, I don't play them consecutively or even uh, when they first came out and whatnot, so they, they weren't too close together when they were being played. Uh, I know there's a big criticism within the uh, Ezio series here, the fact that there's not too many improvements between Assassin's Creed 2 to Brotherhood to Revelations. But uh, honestly, because I am playing them separately and like distanced apart, uh, that's okay with me. I mean, granted, I didn't pay $60 for each game like people would have when they first came out. So obviously, that's why they, they have every right to be upset about that. The fact that it's not making too many improvements. Uh, but they are making improvements between these games. And uh, I noticed them. And they're very fun. Uh, obviously, Assassin's Creed has its, its niche. It knows what it's doing. Uh, it also has its flaws that uh, kind of come out because of its niche. So... Uh, this free form and and uh, acrobatics and all that obviously uh, causes a lot of problems, but it's also very awesome. So uh, you know, it is what it is. I I really enjoyed the game. Uh, I liked the story. I liked uh, finishing it up here. Yeah, Morgs. I mean, I I kind of I kind of agree with you there. Um, and a lot of people. Almost everyone will say Assassin's Creed 2 is the best, but uh, I honestly, I just because I am playing them spaced out, I can see the improvements between them and everything, and uh, I'm not really too hampered by the uh, lack of improvements in certain areas. So yeah, I definitely see improvements everywhere as far as uh, just gameplay, uh, adding new experiences, uh, refining the recruiting and the Brotherhood system. Uh, assassin system and all that I definitely see the improvements and I like them and uh, I would I would have to agree with you I would say for me Revelations thus far is the best game uh, it, it is a bit short though I'll say that it definitely is short um, and I don't know maybe people don't like the fact that you have to stay in one city the whole time but I kind of like that I like the fact that I didn't have to uh, continuously get a loading screen because I had to go to another city and then do another loading screen a million bajillion times uh, I like the fact that it was in one area it was a pretty big area too I wasn't stuck in the exact same spots over and over again but uh, it was definitely a short story but as far as like game mechanics go uh, yeah I'd say Revelations definitely is so far for me the best one although it's not really um it's not really a vast improvement which may be a criticism, I guess. Like, again, if you paid $60 for each game, you, you have every right to be uh, criticizing them for not vastly improving it. But uh, there are improvements in many areas, and uh, I've noticed them, and I've enjoyed them. It's really cool. Yes, and I definitely agree with you, Morgs. Definitely. This was all about all three of these guys, Altier, Ezio, and Desmond. And that's that's very cool. It was a nice uh, story there. Again, it was short, but... um. It was a very cool blending of all three of them together. Although Desmond's memories were, uh, you know, they weren't necessarily in the uh, in the main story. But I mean, you know, I played them as if they were. So yeah, it was very cool. Um, I agree with that completely. 
this mixing and melding, and the fact that it continued on from the original Assassin's Creed, like you found out what happened immediately after he killed the, uh, the head guy, and then it continued on from there, and then it went decades ahead, and that went all the way up to Altier's death, um, it was pretty finely crafted, I'd say. Uh, really, like I said, I, I've repeated it several times now, but the only criticism I would say is it was a very short. It was a very short game. But um, other than that, it was cool. And even the Desmond parts, they were definitely odd. Um, <laughs> yeah, see, you were, they were boring to you and skipped them. They were definitely very odd. Um, they were kind of out of place, I'd say. But, I mean, I don't know. I wouldn't say... I enjoyed them, but I wouldn't say I hated them either. They were just, you know, whatever. Uh, and the stories even that Desmond told weren't too exciting. Like, it is revealing, like, obviously he was raised by the assassins. And, like, obviously learning his backstory. Beginnings, at least, were kind of cool. The rest of it was like, uh, you know, he ran away, he went to New York. Like, okay, whatever. So, I mean, the story there was kind of lacking, and the gameplay was eh. But, I mean, you know... It breaks everything up. It just is unfortunate that uh, <laughs> that the main story here was just so short, but still, definitely fun. Uh, am I going to be doing Black Flag or Rogue? Uh, I do not have Black Flag or Rogue. I have uh, the only game I have now in the Assassin's Creed series is Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, I have that on PC. I have the Digital Deluxe Edition, so it has all the DLC and whatnot. So right now, that's the only other Assassin's Creed game that I have. Um, I will definitely be doing them sometime later, but uh, I don't buy new games because I don't have that kind of money. You know, I don't make any kind of money from Twitch or anything like that. I'm not partnered with Twitch. So uh, I, got, I go to college, so I've got to pay college tuition. I have bills to pay, and I make nothing from Twitch. So uh, <laughs> I definitely cannot afford to be buying new games uh, so I usually buy games like when they're two years old or so uh, you know when they're very cheap pre-owned and they usually have deal, uh, DLC included in it like Game of the Year edition type things so uh, eventually yes I'll be playing Black Flag and Rogue but uh, probably not really anytime soon the only reason I bought Assassin's Creed 3 uh, was because it was super cheap I think it was like 12 bucks or something or the digital deluxe edition which has all the DLC and all that so that was a pretty solid deal there but uh, I'll definitely be playing those type of games it's not really anytime soon that's the one thing uh, I'm new to uh, streaming and all that and it's hard to uh, get viewers when you're new but it's even harder when you're not playing brand new games so uh, you know I stream for fun uh, of course I think like everyone every gamer would say you know, uh, everyone would love to make a full living playing games, but uh, the reality is it's <laughs> it doesn't happen. So uh, for me, you know, of course, I would love to, and I strive to continuously improve this cast and all that, but uh, that can only happen with a lot of time. Uh, it's not going to take a day. It's not going to take a month. It's not going to take a year. It's going to take years to do that if it happens, which is very unlikely, but I'm going to try. You know, so I, I'm going to stream what I have. I'm going to stream what I do. Uh, everyone will know that I generally do not have uh, new games, but uh, <laughs> you know, we'll see. If it catch, if I catch on, I catch on. If not, then you know, it's still fun. You know, I'd be playing these games either way. It's just a matter of me uh, streaming it while I play it. So that's the way I look at it. Uh, but yeah, unfortunately, it's very hard for me to buy new games just because I <laughs> I can't justify forking out like 60 bucks for a certain game when I got other stuff to pay for. So that's why I usually wait until they're they're uh, pretty cheap and they have the DLC. So that way, you know, getting the best bang for your buck, if you will. Yeah, see, everyone wishes it, which is definitely a uh, gamer's dream. Definitely love to be streaming as a job, but uh, it's very tough to happen. Very tough. Alright, well then, uh, seeing as I finished the game here, and uh, I've done Ezio's final memory as well, uh, I will be ending the stream then. Uh, let's see. So as, as for tomorrow, I have class tomorrow. Again, I go to college, so I do have class tomorrow, but I will try to squeeze a stream in um, sometime in like the uh, mid-morning 
into the afternoon. I will try. Like I said, I can't guarantee it, but uh, I'll try to squeeze one in. As for what I'll be playing, uh, not exactly positive. Uh, more than likely, I'll be playing this game just messing around. So, you know, I'll have like, the title like just fooling around in Assassin's Creed or something. So it's nothing important. It's nothing that, uh, that anyone needs to see. It's just me just fooling around here with Assassin's Creed. But who knows, maybe I'll play some random-ass game. Uh, maybe I'll do like an MMO or something, I don't know. But uh, it's not going to be a long stream, probably like two to four hours at most. Probably less than four, I'd say. That's probably kind of long since I have class. But uh, I'll try to come on tomorrow, try to just mess around, do something, we'll hang out. And then, uh, of course, I have Witcher Weekends. Uh, so we will be playing The Witcher, which is fun. It's my first time playing The Witcher, and I am very much enjoying that game. It's cool. But yeah, so we have finally finished here. Assassin's Creed Revelations, the final tale of Ezio here. Uh, very fun. I enjoy it. And uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the follows. It is very cool. And I really do appreciate the support that all you guys give me here. Because uh, I'm just a dude who is playing games and streaming. So it's very cool. And I appreciate everything you guys are always saying about me. Uh, yes, The Witcher. It is a PC-only game. Um, the Witcher 2, however, was also released uh, on Xbox 360. But The Witcher is one of the um, it's one of the most critically acclaimed PC games out there. Uh, if you ask anyone who has a PC about The Witcher, they will all rave about it. Uh, it's an RPG. Uh, like, you, you have a sword and you have a certain kind of magic spells, I would say. So, uh, I don't want to call it hack and slash, because that's not what it is at all. But, um, you know, it's a uh, sword fighting slash magic RPG game. It's very good. I like it. Uh, it is old now, so the mechanics are pretty old. I think it came out in, like, 06 or 07 or something. Uh, but even for that, it's kind of old mechanics. But uh, it's a mature game, and uh, the story is cool because uh, people's responses are like very they're very real like people will be like fuck you man that's stupid like they'll say that because it's a mature game and you can get away with that so uh, <laughs> it doesn't sound important but it's very cool that adds realism to the story even though it's not uh actual realistic but still it's very cool yes you've heard of games like that enjoyed them yeah because i'm enjoying this one it's very awesome so uh, I do play that on the weekends. And uh, of course, I upload that on my YouTube channel as well. So uh, all that stuff is linked right here on my Twitch page. But on my YouTube, I put uh, all my Twitch casts up there. So anything that I'm streaming here on Twitch, I will re-upload back at YouTube. Just so if anyone wants to watch it, or if they didn't get to see it or whatever, they can do that. But uh, I also have videos I post exclusively to YouTube. Uh, I'm taking a break from that right now just because of college and everything. But uh, once that starts back up, I will be posting Prototype 2, which is a, a game that I'm actually really enjoying. I am loving that game. I played the original Prototype. It was a good game. There's nothing too fantastic about it. But uh, Prototype 2, um, I'm seeing vast improvements all around and I'm really enjoying that so uh, I'm not sure when I'll start that post uh, start posting that back up but um it's very cool ah you just got it so far you're enjoying it all right that's very awesome yeah very awesome all right but uh this is gonna do it so uh once again guys thank you for watching thank you for following thank you for all the support uh, I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully, with some uh, some chill gameplay. It'll be a chill cast, because we have nothing much else to do. I don't want to start a new game in the middle of the week, so we'll start the uh, new game next week, which will be uh, Tales of Symphonia Chronicles. Or maybe I'll just do The Witcher full-time, who knows. But uh, I'll try to see you guys tomorrow. Have yourselves a great day, a great night, whatever time of day it is where you are at. Have yourselves a very good one. Uh, enjoy yourselves, have fun, and I will see you later.